Linda Guy here at Bellingrath Gardens. We're getting ready to plant some new roses. What we're gonna do to start with, we've already prepped the bed, but what we need to do is make sure that our row is straight and it's at least a foot away from the sidewalk. So what I use is a 12 inch iron rake to score the bed so we get a straight line. My next step then is I have a stick that I have cut to three feet because roses always need to be spaced three feet apart so they don't compete for nutrients and water and so you have plenty of air circulation to help prevent fungus. So then I'll start marking the bed. So I start with the one on the corner. I mark that off, mark another hole, spread that out, mark another hole, mark another hole. Now we're ready to dig. Now we've got roses in three gallon pots, so we want a hole the size of that three gallon pot. Keep in mind that this whole bed has been prepared. If you're doing a single rose bush without preparing the bed, you need to dig your hole wider so you can get better soil around that bush. Simply take the bush, turn it out of the pot, plant it the same depth that it's growing in the pot. Pull your soil back around. And there you have a planted rose. Always remember when you're finished to water it in well. Even if it's going to rain, you need to water this in with a good soaking hose because you want to uh, eliminate all the air pockets that might have occurred during planting.